Hey, everybody. It's me, TJ. Your favorite, huh? Favorite vlogger. Okay, whatever. Fuck you. You're fools. Actually, you're not. You're, you're, uh, well, some of you are, but most of you are, right? From what I've, uh, I've gleaned from the comment section, you know? Usually the people who comment the f the earliest are the dumbest. Usually, the, like, the first few comments are like, yeah! It's like first, or, uh, second, third, fourth. And then after people get tired of doing that, they just start posting thing like, things like, butts, dicks, ninjas. Very insightful comment. I wonder why, um... I wonder why hate and love are uh, are so wi widely compared to one another. Like these are the two; these are opposites. They're not; they're not really opposites um, because they both require you being invested in another person. Like, there's a lot of people out there that I don't like, but there's very few people I hate. You know, because if you hate someone, then you're thinking about them all the time. Like, you fucking piece of shit. I wish I could fucking strangle that son of a bitch. You know, and if you love someone, you're thinking the opposite. Like, I love that person, man. They're great. I want to do things to them. Whether it be things like giving them a hug or, or whatever, you know. Thing, you know, hugs at the bare minimum and then other stuff. Beyond that, no, not necessarily. I mean, you know, not every, not all love is, uh, is like I want to fuck you, love. There's also just like I want to be there for you in tough situations, kind of love. So you know that that's fine. But like, the really the like love and hate are more similar than anything because they both involve a preoccupation with another person. You know, really the opposite of both of them is is being apathetic towards a person. But, you know, love and hate are weird. Like, it, it, like people, they act like love is always good and hate is always bad. But, I mean, obviously that's not true. You know, a lot of hate is, is justified hate. Like, you know, um, you hate some fucking uh, bigot that's out there preaching um, hateful bullshit. To, to hate that person is, is nothing, there's nothing wrong with that. You know, maybe you maybe someone fucking um, murdered your kids or something. You know, it, it's not wrong to hate that person. It's not bad. Even if someone just annoys you, it's not bad to hate them. It's not bad to just inside of yourself be like, I hate that fucking person. It's it's really not bad. The the the, the it's it's only when you cross the line that it becomes bad. It's only when you say, I hate this person, therefore I am going to do this to them. That's when, when it becomes wrong, depending on, of course, what they did to warrant your hatred in the first place. Um, and love isn't always good. You know, there's, there's plenty of instances where people fall in love with the wrong people, and it's horrible, and it's bad. Uh, you know, like, this, the, like it, it happens with teenage girls all the time. Fucking teenage girl falls in love with some fucking, like, 25-year-old serial rapist or something. <laughs> You know, I mean, there's just, there's a lot of fucking people who fall in love with people that are bad for them. You know, like, what about the guy who uh, is married and has kids and is supposed to be faithful and that's part of the arrangement that is, is you know, he's existing within. And then he falls in love with some fucking, you know, bitch who doesn't even care about him and throws away his entire relationship for the sake of that. You know, that was an instance where love wasn't necessarily good. Uh, you know, I mean, why does everything have to be imbued with, like, positive and ne or, or negative attributes uh, so completely? You know, why do we have to be like, oh, love is good and hate is bad? Why, why are we so uncomfortable with the idea that both of them are kind of morally neutral to begin with? And it really just depends on why you feel that way how you came to feel that way, what you do about feeling that way. I mean, there's a lot of different factors. You know, there's not some inherent goodness to love and some inherent badness to hate. And I guess that was the, the subject of today's vlog. <laughs>